What is going on, everybody? It is the Misfit Bear, and welcome to Shiver. This is actually a point-and-click, free-to-play horror game. It's an indie game, and I don't think I've played very many indie games on the channel. But I'm gonna definitely try it. I'm gonna definitely get in a few more spooks while it's still spooktober. And it's point and click, so this is going to be interesting, at best. So let me make sure all of my settings are good, and we're going to definitely get right on into it. The retirement community is still a few hours away. I hope Dad isn't too lonely there. I'm re having a really hard time keeping my eyes on the road. I've been driving for hours. Yeah, I know that feeling. A cigarette would help right now. Okay, while I don't condone smoking to each his own. GH Reds, just what I need. Okay, so tape player? Too bad there aren't any radio stations out here. Okay, so this is going to be interesting. So far, we're just driving. I really need a smoke first. Uh, speedometer, is there supposed to be a, uh, is there supposed to be, uh, air freshener? My rear view would be naked without it. Speedometer, no cops to be found way out here, no harm in speeding a bit. I uh, don't really can, you know, do speeding either, but we're gonna, this is so new to me. So do I like have a button to press for the menu uh it's point and click i really should have looked at the settings before i started playing this oh there we go it's up like up up i told dad i'd quit but smoking really clears my mind all righty just casual on the road Oh, we got a tape. My road trip mixtape. It keeps me company on the road. So, yes, up here. Okay, cool. Let's put that in. This tape is wicked. Recorded straight from FM. Yep, that's how we did it back in the day, man. We used uh, cassette tapes to record songs. We used the radio to record our ringtones. And they did kind of act like that. <laughs> that actually caught me by surprise. Oh my god. Why am I sweating? This daggum light is too hot. Alright. I, I think my arm is broken. Youch. Rock. Windshield. Yes, let's take this rock. Let's bust the windshield. We're breaking out of here. My arm is definitely broken. I need to get help. Gas tank. My gas cap stayed on. Must still be a few liters in there. Weather warning. A blizzard is rolling in and expected to hit on Tuesday the 13th. Authorities advise individuals remain indoors and under no circumstance attempt to drive. Well, it's a little bit too late for that, isn't it? Embankment. There's no way I can climb up there in this state. There must be a way around. This way. All right, sign. I don't think I have to worry about the poison ivy in this weather. Yeah, that's true. Windy Oaks National Park. Oh, we can go one of two ways. I'll go this way. Windy Oaks National Park. Windy Oaks National Park, Visitor Central, Grand Opening. This game looks really nice. Like I said, I've never played a point-and-click game before, but this is interesting. There's something caught in the tree. I can't quite reach it. Is that blood? Looks like it's rotting from the inside. The sign looks like it's due to be replaced. Uh, let's go here. 
closed until further notice. For concerns and questions, please contact Ray Holden, Provincial Parks Minister, signed Ray Holden. A heavy duty lock, not a very welcoming sight, but I mean, it's supposed to be the grand opening. They had balloons and all of that stuff, and now it's closed? Filthy and empty inside. I can relate. Yep, sure can. I could see inside. Wait, I'm not going to go look? Danger! High volt! Hey, an axe! Or hatchet. I feel better with a hatchet in hand. Uh, generator. I got a rubber hose. It's out of gas. Oh! Okay, I understand. So if I can find, like, a gas tank... Oh, it even leaves behind footprints. That's cool. So if I can find a gas tank, then I can siphon the... Okay. I was about to say, why did everything get quiet? It's an old oak tree. The only one I've seen so far. I don't want to go up that way yet. So let's go back. Let's keep going. Let's go this way. An outhouse. It's exactly like you would expect in there. <laughs> yeah, shitty. Literally. Don't forget, check out Mort's Mine. Go to the visitor center for details about tours. Was that a little mole? Oh yeah, it is a mole. <laughs> Trash bin. Old food wrappers and other general garbage. Alright, so let's go this way. Oh. So I did find my way around. Interesting. Snow pile. A loose patch of snow. Dad and I would use these to hold our beer cans. <laughs> so this is literally where I went. This guardrail really could have tried harder. Yeah, it could have. I mean, my arm is broken. My butt's all sprained. And I need a gas can. But we're going to go up this way. Oh, we're going right into the mine. Bleak Flats Mine. Haha, -ha, watch your head. Uh, I think I'm going to be needing to watch a little bit more than that. Lantern. An empty lantern. I wonder if I can find some fuel for it. Yes, indeed I can. Al, sorry to let you know like this, but I'm done. I'm going home and not coming back. I gave my key card to Josh to look after. I can't keep going into that mine. It's seriously freaking me out. The darkness and sounds honestly make me wonder if something is down there. That combined with all the stories Josh keeps telling me about the miners that were never found during the sinkhole disaster is more than I can handle. So here's my notice of resignation, Samantha. Well, Samantha, I will say, is by far the smartest person thus far in this game. A great, a faint, rancid breeze blows from the gate. That's lovely. And the reason why I say that she is the smartest person thus far is because I'm going to be going in there. All right, so can I... Wait, do I take the hatchet to it? That doesn't seem to work. The rubber hose. Yeah, I didn't need a gas can after all. I just needed the empty lantern. Says to use, only use ethanol-based fuel. Uh, well, shady gas pump. I need a container to siphon the gas. Well, apparently I still need a gas can then. Oh, would you look at that? I did not register that that was supposed to happen. It's an old scrap of coat. I found a key in the pocket. Okay. And this key goes right here. We're going to walk in here. It looks relatively clean in here. It's just as cold in here as out there. I need to get the heater running. Niwo mineral water. An empty two liter. Oh, that's what we're going to use to siphon the gas. Note, Josh, I need you to call me as soon as you find this note. 
I don't know what kind of prank you are trying to pull, but you can't just disappear with two guests in the mine. The police have been contacted and they want to start a proper investigation when the storm dies down. This is a very serious situation, so please contact me at once and I'll be over to sort everything out. You can call me using the radio in the back room. I know you have Samantha's card to get in. When you do that, when you do that, I'll be over within minutes, Al. Okay, well it seems to me somebody met a very sad end, but let's go and get this uh, fuel at least. I got an achievement called Zeus. The generator started, I should get inside and see if I can contact help somehow. Yeah, apparently I am Zeus for being able to start a generator. Wildlife warning. Windy Oaks National Park. Stay safe, do not feed the animals. I mean, come on. You see you see that right there? You see that? Who wouldn't feed me? They can feed themselves, lazy bastards. <laughs> Ooh, it looks like there might be a radio behind that door. I wonder if I can get in. Well, no, there's the, the freaking thing with the key card, the card reader. Now that it has power, I just need the key card. So we got a vending machine, all off-brand snacks. I'd rather avoid this. I heard they can give you cancer. Cup. Stashed bottle. Latvian Soviet Socialist Republic 193 proof vodka. Wow! That was a mouthful. They must have gotten it used. It's seen better days. Painting. Classical yet radical. Alright, let's move on. Let's try to find this. Okay, so now the game is forcing me to go discover what that was. Um, excuse you? Alrighty, down we go into the scary mine. Oh, don't you even. I'm jumping already. Downward spiral. Why are there claw marks on the button? Oh, oh, yo, look at that. The light follows uh, the finger. Why am I down here? Some pretty heavy construction is underway. I doubt it is anymore. Audio guide. It looks like they're turning this into a tourist attraction. Bare bottom, extra dark. What you trying to say? Uh-uh. The last time I did this crap was in Man of Medan, and I got jump scared. Don't jump scare me. Oh, Jesus, mother I don't like it. I don't like it. Why? These bars look like solid iron, much newer than the weathered stone archway. Why? Looks like a pretty sturdy latch. I need to think of something clever. Screwdriver? Maybe if I had a bobby pin. Something tells me I won't find one down here. Let's just hatchet the motherfucker. You have to weaken the lock. A boot. Why does that remind me of Amnesia the Dark Descent? Because there was a part in that game down in the prison where you ironically went down a humongous elevator and you had to, you know, melt a heavy duty lock to move forward. It's an old coffee grinder. Shame it's out of coffee. All right, so there's no way I'm gonna just covered in rust. I'm not gonna look in that again. So there's nothing more in here. Can I use the jackhammer? No, I can't use the jackhammer. Okay, so I have to be creative with this, I guess. Let's see if I can't figure this out. 
Oh. Wait. Hold on. Do coffee grinders literally work like that? Because that was a aluminum can. That's interesting. H hold on a second. Is this like a science thing? Am I going to have to like put that to no? Am I going to have to put that to no? Am I going to have to put that to no? Then why did I need to do that then? Uh, so after a little bit of searching, I have it figured out. See, the rust on that cart was there for a reason. Because the sign to the left of the mole said, if you take rust and combine it with aluminum powder, you get thermite, which melts through metal. And people. Ah, oh, gotta love science, man. Got to love science. There we go. My hatchet is broken. Uh, that's nice to know. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, please, no. I don't even know where I'm going. Oh, it's like that, huh? It's a dadgum maze. Oh, come the fuck on. Here we freaking go. Nope, wrong way again, huh? Yep, so I was technically going the right way the first time out of sheer fear. That's not it. Oh, I can't go back. Oh, what a load of bull crap. Right, left, right, straight, left. Yeah, there we go. All right. What is all of this over here? Why does this look like... Oh, God, I don't like this vent. This ventilation shaft might lead to the surface, but it's hopelessly out of reach. Yeah, that's the ventilation shaft where the, uh, the uh, excuse me, uh, that I saw earlier. Old minecart. It looks like nobody has been here in years. I'm trying to figure out what the heck happened. I don't like this at all. Oh, why is everything shaking? Oh, there's a card in the pocket. Okay, I have the key card. Is that supposed to be the sinkhole? Can, can, can I leave now? I'm getting shivers all over my body. Wait, I don't remember this. Do I have to go backwards? It was right, left, right, straight, left. So is it left, straight, right, left? Oh no. Oh, oh, thank God. It's broken. What? What? It, it's broken. But why though? How else am I supposed to get out? Man, that took me forever to find. Oh man. Oh my gosh. Please let me get out. These bars are screwed tight. 
Okay. There we go. Screwdriver. We're gonna get out of here, right? We're gonna get out of here. Or we could just go through here. Oh, thank God. The forest feels somehow darker than before. Yeah, I bet it does. There is no telling how long we were down there. But, at least... We can come in here. Go in there. Reminds me of my days at security using the card reader. And then we're gonna go in the door. Fireworks. Not exactly a flare, but I think it could work. Hey, anything is better than nothing. Emergency radio. Oh yeah, that's right. Uh, those call signs were there. Ow, I got it used second hand. It saved the park 15 bucks. No need to thank me. I left some instructions for who we should call when we need help. I copied them down exactly from one of the new books. Ranger Eastley. For God's sake, Josh, you were going to fix this and it is coming out of your wages. Ow. Josh, what the hell did you do with the emergency call signs book for the radio? It is like further up, right? Death and dismemberment call sign. One, tune the frequency to the marked number. I circled it in red pen after taking apart the case. Hopefully I put everything back where it was supposed to go. Two, set the call sign to our closest ranger tower, Logan Watchtower. Flip the switch. After you've done this, just shoot a flare by the highway and someone will be here faster than you can say, ah, stop the bleeding. Logan Watch Tower. Hmm, this isn't quite right. I should try it again. Oh, okay, so there we go. Hello, Josh. Yeah. You're not coming through. Light a flare by the highway so Al can locate you. Over. Okay, that should do it. I should get to the highway and light a signal. All right. We're going to go. Oh, Jesus Christ. Just get me out of here. 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 Just get me out of here, man. Just get me out of here, man. No, not that way. Not that way. We're, not the, we're going this way. Oh my gosh. What the fuck? I need a distraction. A loud noise near the highway. Can I go back? Can I do something with the car? My car's a wreck. I'm lucky I even survived the crash. What can I do though? Oh, firecrackers. Okay. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. But what am I going to use to make a signal? What am I going to use? Roman candle. Makeshift flare. Okay. So let's light that bad boy. Please. Anyone. Don't jump scare me. Holy uh, are you all right, son? Absolutely not. Oh, my aching heart. <laughs> 
Oh my aching heart. Man, I tell you what. That was different. But that was scary none the fucking less. Oh my god. For as small as it was, like I said, that is why the indie genre is so good. Because that was such a tiny game. A tiny game. I literally finished it in like an hour. Well, as far as recording time, not even an hour and a half. But the majority of that was a lot of walking around. But still, that is... Oh, dad should be back in a minute. Wait, there's more? The sun's almost up. Looks like the weather's clearing up too. It's been a hell of a week. You know what? I'm good for now. Dad did this one in one of his classes. He's really proud of it. Looks like Wendy Oaks is closing. The paper talks about disappearances and a mysterious vandal. What is this? Fall alert? It's tempting, but I really shouldn't panic the nurses. Oh, did he like get hurt or something? I don't know, and I don't have anything in my inventory. Oh, hey dad. Sorry, I was lost in thought. That was good. That was so good. Oh, man. Woo, that got my heart pumping, man. Oh, my gosh. That was so good. I hope y'all enjoyed that. It's by far the first indie game that has ever been played on the channel. And you know, I, I might look into doing some more. You never know. I have thought about it at one point, but I just didn't get around it. But man, it was very small. It was the atmosphere that got you. Oh man, I do hope y'all enjoyed it. If you did, give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, consider subscribing for more of this heart-stopping mayhem. Until next time, I appreciate all of you for watching. Like and subscribe for more, for I will continue to make these videos for Mini Moons. Stay safe out there, and never forget to holla at your bear. Peace out.